Yeah, so if you want to extend the lead on the DS18B20 thermometer, this is the uh, sort of waterproof one that you can buy off uh, sort of flea based scammers and all these places. Um, you can uh, you do it quite successfully just with some uh, a bit of Cat5 data cable. Um, the fact that these uh, you've got inside one of these cables, you've got uh, four pairs or eight wires, um, mean that uh, it should cancel out a bit of interference and crosstalk between the between the wires. What you've got on the uh, on the DS is uh, five volts neutral and signal. Now you need to put a 4.7k resistor uh, at the end or somewhere uh, between your data pin and your uh, live uh, because this, this this needs a bit of power but not too much. Word of warning, don't fuck that up. I was holding one of these and uh, screwed up the wiring and uh, well I had a nice line across the, <laughs> across the hand there uh, these get fucking hot. So anyway, but th this can be done quite successfully. So I've got a bit of heat shrink here to go over the final uh, slide over the final joint. Um, I'm just going to solder these up, and uh, I've had this working over about 15 meters or so. Uh, I dare say with um, it could be extended further. Don't know the difference between Cat Five and Cat Six. Whether uh, Cat Six would extend it further? Probably, probably not. What I have done is. Uh, the twist rates in the four different pairs inside the data cable are different. If we have a look here, so we've got green. Green's got quite a high twist rate. Um, so is orange. They're in uh, Ethernet networking. They're transmit and receive. And the brown and the blue pairs of uh, twisted cable aren't used uh, in standard Ethernet. They are, however, used in power over Ethernet. So what I've done with all this kind of stuff is I stick with brown for power and I use either the green or the orange for data. Um, green's got the higher twist rate so in actual fact the because uh, it's twisted tighter it's uh, you, you, it's a longer actual wire distance but uh, in this application here I've got a total cable length probably of about four meters it's not gonna make a blind bit of difference and uh, I've I've brought some uh, some other ones in, and my colour scheme is green for the sensor for the for the data wire. So, just going to stick to that. So I'll get this soldered up, and that will be uh, that will work just fine.